Grace and peace. My name is Timothy Brindle. Uh, privileged to be a recording artist with Lamp Mode Recordings. And this is True Story. So I was born in Pittsburgh in 1980. Uh, grew up in the inner city of Pittsburgh until I was 18 and I decided to come to Temple University in Philadelphia uh, to pursue uh, fun uh, while out uh, in the underground hip-hop scene, uh, do some graffiti, um, do some other things that are under the blood um, and the Lord ended up using that to bring me to Christ after I got pretty low in my sin a week before 9-11 uh, and I've been here since. Um, and in God's kindness, he led me to Shai Lin about five or six weeks after I got saved. Uh, and Shai just took me under his wing, uh, started bringing me through the Book of Romans week by week, just loving on me. And pretty soon, uh, the truth of Christ and, uh, and his gospel and what he's done at the cross and his resurrection began coming out in the music uh, as Shai was already making music for Christ. so excited to be at Westminster, man. It's uh, not only is the campus like just a safe haven from the hecticness of Philly, uh, as my family and I own a home in West Philly, but just learning uh, of the amazing rich truths of Christ and the gospel and, and God and his greatness and his glory and what that means for us to now go take this gospel to broken, messed up, jacked up people like me um, and see that uh, Christ's grace is enough to restore the most messed up of people uh, and that Christ who has defeated death, who is reigning now, uh, is restoring this world. He is restoring the globe uh, through his kingdom, through his kingdom reign. So this place is just making me excited for ministry, whether that be counseling or preaching or missions. Um, and it has much implications for my family as I seek to minister uh, to my children and, 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 and wife. My wife and I seek to minister this gospel uh, to our kids. It's so great learning of the Father's love for me as um, I have my beloved son here uh, who is the image of me um, as the son is the image of his father and we are being made into the image of the son as children of God. Anything you want to say, Micaiah? That's all right. So in my biblical counseling class, I had to come up with a phrase that defines me in seven words. A ruined, restored, grace recipient. If you're a believer in Jesus, this really defines you as well. Let me just break it down real quick because this has to do with my passion in music, in ministry, in church, and family. First off, in and of myself, I'm ruined. I'm unable to change myself because of Adam and Eve's sin and my participation in the fall. I'm at enmity with God. I'm against God and what I want is not what He likes and uh, I'm enslaved to my sinfulness. However, in Christ, I have another story. Because of faith in Jesus, I'm now united and attached and joined to him who has died for sin. He's defeated sin in his resurrection, and I too have been raised up with him. I've been restored back to God. Not only have I been, been restored back to God, I'm being restored in my condition, uh, in my heart. And it's all because of being a recipient of grace. I've received grace. The grace of Jesus is by the Father. I'm now just as embraced as he is. When the Father sees his Son resurrecting from the dead, ascending into heaven, he says, come, my beloved Son, I'm happy with you. And because I'm in Christ, because I'm in the beloved, he says the same every day when I come to him. So the Restoration album is really living and feeding off of who we are in Jesus as grace recipients who have been restored back to the Father, as He continues to restore us, and He will restore us on that great day when He returns again. Amen. <laughs>